Hi there, so welcome to this free little tapping video, which is all about saying no. Uh, this is definitely something that I have struggled with myself, and I'm sure that you have on occasion too. Um, I think that as women, we tend to take on a lot. Um, and in my case, it's very much about pleasing people, wanting people to be happy, <laughs> uh, putting the needs of other people before my own, and also just feeling not quite confident to say, no, because <laughs> uh, it's a hard word to say. Um, you know, we're just programmed to just say yes to everything. And then we end up just getting overwhelmed and frustrated with ourselves and with other people and resentful, and that is no good for anybody. So before we start tapping, if you can just make sure you've got some water to hand or have a drink of water. Obviously, by tapping along with me, you agree to take full responsibility for your own health and well-being. So we're just going to start off then with some nice deep breaths. So you can put your hand just on your heart chakra if you want to. So breathing in through the nose and hold two, three, four, and breathing out two, three, four, five, six, seven, and breathing in two, three, four, and hold two, three, four, and breathing out two, three four, five, six, seven. Last one, breathing in, two, three, four, and hold, two, three, four, five, six, and out, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well done. So we're just gonna start on the karate top point. My dog's come up to say hello, hello. <laughs> Even though, hello. I don't like saying no, I love and accept myself. Even though feeling no, saying no makes me feel really awkward. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm a yes person and a people pleaser, and I say yes to lots of things, and sometimes that leaves me feeling a bit frustrated, I deeply and completely love honour and accept myself. I'm not comfortable saying no to people. When someone gives me a choice, I try and read what they want me to say. I nod, <laughs> like I'm really agreeing with what, the, what they, they're saying. And inside I'm saying, no. But outside I'm saying, yeah, sure. <laughs> Even though I didn't really want to do that thing for that person. I feel really easily influenced about it sometimes. And sometimes I feel a bit pathetic. Because I just can't say no. And I justify my yes with stupid reasons and I don't give myself enough time to think properly. And I want to stay in their good books and make them happy. And saying no means that I might have to gauge their reaction. And they might be cross with me. They might feel let down by me. And that's not a very nice feeling. And sometimes I feel obligated to say yes, even though I really, really want to say no. All this fear and worry about saying no. Why does that word feel so uncomfortable to me? Why does that word feel so uncomfortable to so many other people? And why do I give myself away so freely? Without truly thinking things through. Without thinking about my family and the impact on them. And certainly not even thinking for one minute about myself. 
and what I need. It's almost like I put everyone else's needs before my own. And sometimes just saying yes feels easier. Sometimes saying less makes me feel that that's all I'm really worth. Just yes, yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, sure. Bring it on. But the problem is I end up taking on too much. And then I just end up feeling overwhelmed. I'm frustrated with myself. Why is it so hard to say no? N-O spells no. <laughs> and even on the rare occasion where I do say no, I pad it out. And I say, I'm so sorry, I'm really sorry. I can't do that today. But I'll tell you what, I'll do loads of other stuff for you instead. <laughs> Another time. When I don't actually need to give all those reasons and excuses. I can just say no. It's okay to just say no. So I'm going to have a little practice over the next few days. I'm going to try and say no. And if that's much too difficult for me, I'm going to say Maybe, can I get back to you? And then I can say no. But I need to bear in mind that it's much easier to just say no straight away. So that then I'm not giving anyone any false hope or expectation. And I know that deep down if people knew how I was feeling about this, they probably wouldn't even ask me. And they would respect me more if I was just honest and admitted that I'm taking on too much, that I'm feeling overwhelmed right now. And that this time, it's a no. Imagine feeling more confident saying no. I can imagine feeling myself being confident saying no. Imagining it now, in my head. No. 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 No need for apologies. No need for reasons. No need for excuses. And what I want you to do now is just continue tapping through these points. You can just follow me. And I want you to think about scenarios in your head where you've said yes to things. And I want you to just remember what was said. And I want you to remember how you felt. How you dealt with that situation. And how you felt afterwards in the days and weeks after that event. Just do that now for me. Close your eyes if you need to. Just imagine that scenario. Someone in your life that's always asking for stuff. 
maybe even taking advantage sometimes. Or maybe just not knowing how much you've got on. Or maybe it's someone that you just really want to please. So just tapping through. Let me do one round in silence while you do that. Okay, well done. Now what I want you to do <clears throat> is rewind. So that scenario, just take it right back to the beginning. Right back before they got in contact with you, what you were doing that day, if you can remember. And I want you to remember now what they asked you to do for them. And I want you to now visualise yourself saying no. You don't have to give an excuse. You don't have to give a reason. But you can tell the truth if you need to. Imagine yourself just saying no. If it's really uncomfortable for you, I want you to just think about other solutions that you might be able to offer that person. But don't involve your time. Okay, well done. So I'm just going to do one more round now just to affirm that. I feel more confident to say no. And I know that it's okay to say no. And I know that I should always put my needs first. Because if I'm struggling, then what effect is that going to have on everyone around me? And my ability to take care of my family my ability to take care of business and my general sense of well-being. I accept that I need to say no more often and I believe that with my whole mind and body. Okay, hand on your heart chakra now, nice deep breath in nice deep breath out let it all out well done if you've still got some residual feelings that are coming up for you then you can just keep on tapping but otherwise have a great few next weeks where you are saying no a lot more often and see how it feels for you okay take care bye